Greetings and a warm welcome to all our viewers on the digital platform of Legally Speaking. Today we bring you the latest update regarding the Lakhimpur Khairi violence case. The Supreme Court on Monday relieved the special investigation team said in the Lakhimpur Khairi violence case stating that the SID had already concluded its investigation and submitted a charge sheet in the trial court. The case is related to the violence that occurred on October 3, 2021, in which 8 individuals, including 4 farmers, lost their lives in the Tikunia area of Lakhimpur Khairi district. A bench of Justice Surya Khan and Justice Dipankar Datta also mentioned that if there arises a need to reconstitute this seat, an appropriate order will be passed. The Apex Court had previously appointed Justice Rakesh Kumar Jain, a former judge of the Punjab and Haryana High Court, to oversee on a day-to-day -day basis the Uttar Pradesh Police State's investigation into the case. The seat included three senior IPS officers, S.B. Shirodkar, Dipinder Singh and Padmaja Chauhan. On July 11, the Supreme Court extended the interim bail of Ashish Mishra, the son of Union Minister Ajay Kumar Mishra, who is facing prosecution in the case until September 26. The violence occurred during a protest by farmers against the visit of Uttar Pradesh Deputy Chief Minister Kesha Prasad Maurya to the area. Four farmers were reportedly mowed down by an SUV and subsequently a driver and two BJP workers were allegedly lynched by enraged farmers. A journalist also lost his life in the violence leading to widespread outrage among opposition parties and farmer groups who were protesting against the now repelled agriculture laws introduced by the central government. So that's the latest on Lakhimpur Khairi violence case. For more legal updates, please like, share and subscribe to our channel.